Sometimes a person's ability is determined by the size of their drive, and a skateboard enthusiast from the Metro is proving that. The loss of a leg cannot hold him back from skating or leading others to greatness. Fox 4 Sean McDowell shows us how he'll soon inspire others on a national stage. Losing his leg was the best thing that ever happened to him. Now that might sound odd, but Gladstone native Matthew Hawkins says that car crash, which happened in 2008, helped open him to the world of adaptive skating. 36-year-old Hawkins says he's been enlisted by ESPN and the Summer X Games to bring adaptive skating back to that extreme sports show. Didn't think I'd ever skateboard again. That 2008 car crash happened, according to Hawkins, when a drunk driver ran him off the road. His leg was injured and eventually amputated as a result of the wreck. My guardrail went through the side of my Mustang and cut my seat in half. We are rolling. Instead of giving up, Matthew gave adaptive skating a try and he's never looked back. Hawkins is part of a group organized by Burning Spider Stoke Shop in Kansas City that teaches others to dominate the deck. Adaptive Action Sports, which is based in the Metro, works with ESPN and enlisted Hawkins' expertise for the Summer X Games, where adaptive skateboarding will be seen by the entire world. The numbers are uh, they're growing. I mean, all around the world, we find new adaptive skateboarders. So it's huge that we finally have a platform where they can showcase what they can do. Matt is absolutely awesome. Joe right. Burnham knows Matt and his inspirational story well. He owns the Burning Spider Shop, and he's proud that Hawkins has become a role role model to skaters who might not have tried without his example. The dude is all about building people up and showing people what they can do and what that no matter what their situation is or what their current ability is. Hawkins says he wants to open even more adaptive athletes to skateboards. He told me that his vision is to build an indoor skate park in the metro open year round with adaptive athletes in mind. He says the more people who give it a try, that means more people will believe they can. Sean McDowell, Fox 4 News. That is inspiring. Yes. Very cool. Now, the Summer X Games begin on August 1st in Minneapolis.